What's going on, YouTube subscribers? You know, before I get started, you know, smack that notification bell. You dig, uh, you know, get me up there, you feel me? Uh, you know. I wanted to just, you know, comment, talk about certain things. You dig what I'm saying? You know, I'm always giving up positive things in life. You feel me? That's just how I do. You feel me? You know, you know when you're trying to change your life, you know what I'm talking about? You just got to do it. Just keep pushing and fight for it. You feel me? And that's changing your life. You dig? But anyway, uh, you know, smash that notification bell. You know what I'm saying? Give me about 500. You dig what I'm saying? To 1,000. You know what I'm saying? Whatever you feel in your heart. You did. If you don't, that's cool too. I don't get nothing at all. That's cool too. I'm still gonna put speak positive things out there. You heard me? But anyway, now me, I, I don't understand why. I, I'm, I'm be honest with you. It's, I'm, I'm be like probably in two different spots. You know, speaking and different things. Might be two or three, something like that. Might be a little longer. I don't know. But anyway, I'm gonna get straight to the point. You feel me? You know, uh, I don't understand why uh, we have to fight one another like. Like, say, like, if you got a business, right, and you and your friend, y'all together, y'all chilling, woo, 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 you know what I'm talking about, and then y'all get through, through some problems, you dig what I'm saying, like, you know, you, you know what I'm saying, y'all having to bump heads on certain type of levels, you know, and then some of them get mad, be like, you know, they don't want you in their city, they don't want you to come, you know, you can't come taking no business and all that, putting your business in their business, so taking money out of their pocket too. You know what I'm saying? I just be watching a lot of stuff like when, when, when you know, a lot of people say this. I ain't, a majority of a lot of people say this here. You know what I'm saying? They talk about my city, my this, my this, my this. I keep saying the same thing over and over. You can't tell nobody where to come. You can't tell nobody where to open a shop at. You see what I'm saying? Martin Luther King put us in this space so we can get along with each other you dig what i'm saying he won't he get he, he gonna this freedom for us see what i'm saying because nine times ten you know what i'm saying you got to remember what they used to do back in the days you feel me we ain't too much had no stuff back in the day we couldn't go certain areas certain spots and it's still like that you know what i'm saying i'm not no pressured person but i i keep it i keep it one thousand on my show Certain spots you came or walk in that area. Certain spots you came or drive through that area. You feel what I'm saying? And I'm from Miami, and I know. You feel what I'm saying? Like certain parts of inner Georgia, I'm quite sure. Inner Georgia, where everybody from. At certain parts you came or dangle in that area. You know what I'm saying? Without you getting locked up or whatever. But anyway, I say this to say this. Don't matter what race you, what color you, it be your own race. What I you know, you know what I'm talking about? It be your own race that will tell you if they mad at you, whatever. If y'all got a problem, y'all don't slip around each other. Or you don't slip with somebody else's ex girlfriend or whatever. Woo, 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 woo. You know what I'm saying? That ain't no good friend anyway. If you sleep around somebody else, ex, and you know that person that used to, you know what I'm saying, smash out. You dig what I'm saying? How you gonna? You, you dig what I'm saying? How you gonna really? You know what I'm saying? Do that to that person that was your friend. So. If y'all bump heads, then say like if you own some a business or a store. You dig what I'm saying? Clothes, shoes, or a tattoo shop or whatever. You feel me? Y'all fall out. You dig what I'm saying? I be seeing like on like uh Black Ink. When I be saying I don't know don't ask that little problem now, but you know I don't like to bring stuff. I let let grown men do grown man things. I'm a grown man, you feel me? But a person should tell nobody else where they can't come open a shop at. That person, this world is a free country. You supposed to do whatever you want to do in life. You feel what I'm saying? Do what life is. Enjoy yourself. You can set up shop anywhere you want to set up shop at. That's like somebody on the street corner. The street corner will tell you you can't come to this city. You can't do this. And do, 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 do. But they got to understand. You, why you telling a the person they come, they can't come set up shop at your city? And they come set up shop uh Doing something in your in, in, around in your neighborhood, whatever, whatever the case might be. You dig what I'm saying? I ain't gonna see it on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? I don't like saying all that. But anyway, y'all get me. The street person, y'all know what I'm talking about. You feel me? But uh, you don't. You know what I'm saying? You can't tell nobody where to set up shop at because that's still not yours. You feel me? We, we want to sit there and, and kill one another, shoot one another, and fight one another because we don't want nobody else to come in. And do what they do because y'all now y'all got a problem now y'all beef with one another you feel me now y'all want to just sit back and just 
you know, we fight one another and all this and that. Deal. I'm like, man, you know, I, me, I just don't get it. You know what I'm talking about? We don't own this. I'm just being honest with y'all. We do not own none of this. You feel me? And the person that think they own it, I don't care if you're a white man, I don't care if you're a black man. If you think you own this world, what's in it? You's a liar, and you got another thing coming for you. You don't, God own everything in this world. See what I'm saying? Because you got some people don't stole something from everybody's ancestor. I don't care what color you is. You dig what I'm saying? And believe me, I'm not no prejudiced person. I don't care what nobody say. You can say I'm me or say man. I don't care. You feel what I'm saying? God, God know my heart, and he know I ain't no, and he know for a fact that I'm not no selfish person. Real talk. Man, I like beat me up, y'all. Messing up my little view, view. You feel me? I gotta do a little better, y'all. I'm sorry about that, y'all. Nah, this still beaming through there. What's going on today? I ain't gonna tighten up. Oh, man. It is what it is, y'all. But anyway, it might be a little dog, but it's cool. Anyway, I don't understand why people just do that to certain people. You feel what I'm saying? It's like, you know what I'm talking about? People always got something to say about everybody doing what we do, how we do, what we can't do. I mean, I, mean, I, I just don't get none of it. You feel me? I just don't get none of it. I don't believe none of it. You know what I'm saying? I don't care what nobody else say, man. You feel me? You don't you don't let other people tell you where you can't stay or move or move at. You know what I'm saying? As long as you this world is a free world, it's a free country. God put us here for a reason. But I remind you now, you got some whites and blacks, you got some Spanish, however. Every race color. You got some think they own certain things in life. Certain place you can't come chill and stay and you know have a good time. You dig what I'm saying? However you choose how to live your life. You feel me? But you got some type of people, man, they just don't you know our own black people just shoot us and kill us and try to run us out of the area, right? You got some white people do their own race like that. No matter what race it is, everybody doing their own race the wrong way. But we shouldn't do our own race the wrong way. We should all bind together, stick together, blacks and whites. That was Martin Luther King. He, he, when he sought that dream, when he said I had a dream, he, you know what I'm saying, he was trying to get us all together so we could stand on, stand on 10 toes, you know, you dig what I'm saying, and then stand 10 feet tall. You dig, but, you know, we, we, we can't do that because we study out here trying to hate on one another. Blacks hate no blacks, whites hate no whites. You dig what I'm saying? White people hate no black people, black people hate no white people. Black people hate no Spanish, man, they hate no black. It's just all different race, man. Just we just tackling one another for no reason. You dig what I'm saying? But you know what I mean? I, I don't understand what they purpose of doing. It's like like you know what I'm saying? Like the government, right? You know what I'm saying? And I'm 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 reminding you on something that's gonna really, really, you know what I'm saying, peep your own game. Now, how can you now uh If you don't board a house, right? You don't talk, you don't pay slap cash for, it, right? And you still gotta pay taxes on the house. You still gotta pay taxes on the land too. Now sometimes that might be carrying together. You feel me? But I'm finna say this here: How can you pay taxes on a house and and you don't pay for cash, right? But you still gotta pay taxes every year. So that that telling me, right? If I die, right, and the house is paid for, right? If you ain't got your kids taking care of that house, like come behind and take care of that house and keep paying taxes, right? The government will have it, the bank will have it. So I'm like, well, you should buy a house for, and it's still really not yours, and it really not really ours. It ain't. When you die. You can't care none of that with you, right? 
Feel me on this here. You, you can't carry none of that with you, right? Only thing, only thing is on that house is on your, your name, right? Feel me now? When you die, your name, it, it, it don't matter to nobody no more. Because when you die, your name erased. Real talk. Your name erased. None of this ain't yours no more. But while you on earth, you trying to make sure you got your name on that yours. No. Only thing on that lease on your car or house is this your name. That's it. You miss any payment. Uh, if you don't pay for a car, if you ain't got no, no money to pay for it every year, your taxes, whatever, they still snatch it from you. So to me, where is the law showing that we got to pay taxes on this? I ain't seen no law about that. But they'll show everything in law on certain level of certain things in life. But that there, I don't see it. I feel like if you pay for cash or you don't pay for it, it shouldn't be no taxes. That's how I'm going to tell y'all why I say I don't vote. Because the government got their own hustle. Just like, I'm a, if I'm a street person, I'm about there in the street, I got my own hustle game, right? The government got their own hustle too. They know how to play in your head, play in your mind, thinking that, you dig what I'm saying, that it's good to vote so you can get this and have it. That's a lie. You can vote all you want, and you still ain't going to get none of that. You still ain't going to get heard. You got private people. I don't care what color you is. You got somebody still in the mud out here, baby. You heard me? And they ain't, they ain't been spoken. They ain't been heard. You dig what I'm saying? They ain't getting the help. They ain't getting the treatment that they need. You know what I'm saying? You got people can't read. You know what I'm saying? Then, and then they do that, tell you enough you can't get your disability because you got to go out there to my work three, four more years. You feel what I'm saying? That's crazy to me. But you got people out here playing dumb dumb like they crazy. They get a check and be young people ain't ain't working but but a year at McDonald's somewhere. And they can go play stuff crazy and they'll get a fat check. But they'll tell a person like me, fifty some, fifty two years old, that I got to get out there and work some more. And they already know my background. That's crazy to me. I I, I don't get none of it. But but you know what I'm saying. But the government, the government like this here, the government, they know how to finesse you. They know how to play them same games. See, I'm, I'm going to tell you something. They play behind the bookway game. So that's how they can, they can really adapt to some people that they don't know nothing. They slow in the game. But when you got a street person don't been in the streets, and you looking back, so you know what? The government and the streets, the government... They give you wrong stuff to do. You know how? You be out there. I don't like to say certain stuff, but I'm, I'm going to say this. You be out there on certain things selling certain stuff, right? So the government, he be out there selling you certain stuff. Have you selling certain stuff, but have you still paying taxes on stuff that's wrong? You feel what I'm saying? And God asks everything wrong what, what the world is offering us. And that's real. Selling liquor, beer, cigarettes, tobacco, reefer. Reefer for beer medicine. You feel what I'm saying? There's a lot of things on earth that God put on the earth for medicine. For not to misuse it. But we we people, we look at a certain different type of level, different way. But it's, it's you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. But I'm just saying this here right now. The government got their own ways. They got their own ways of tricking you. They real talk. They got their own ways of tricking you, man. Own ways of tricking you. It's a hustle game. It's a hustle game behind that white desk, the White House. It's a hustle game. It's never the mind game. That's all it is. If they can talk good enough to get you to vote and put up black people, white people to say rappers, singers, whatever, and say put your vote in to vote. I'm going to tell you something, 9 times out of 10, that singer, that rapper, they're getting paid for say that. And 9 times out of 10, right? They know they get paid for the commercial clips, however. You dig what I'm saying? They're getting paid for that. They're getting paid for that. You feel me? So I'm going to tell you something. You got to recognize the game, baby. The game is, is right there in your face if you just open your eyes and quit trying to be blind. Be blind for love for man. 
I want to be blind in love for God. That's why I think he, he give me a lot of stuff that the government can't really do nothing for none of us. But God can if we stick together. But see, we so caught up on man. We so caught up on uh, living a lifestyle. You dig what I'm saying? It's a lot of us is blind. What we really trying to see. That's just real talk, man. That's just real talk. A lot of us is blind what we trying to really see. You know what I'm saying? And you know, it's a lot of people teaching us the wrong thing. You know what I'm saying? That goes for, you know, somebody preaching to you, whatever. They say they're teaching us the wrong thing coming out the Bible. Some people do, some people don't. You feel what I'm saying? But that's crazy. So that's why it's best to get, I don't care if you don't know how to read at all. Talk to God. He will give you some type of clarity. But most people look at me right now, they'll be like, oh, this, this dude don't know what he's talking about. But one day y'all wish, you know what I'm saying, you really had to listen to me. And that's just true facts, man. You can vote all you want. Don't you know you got people been voting, man, before we was born? It don't got a little better. That's it, a little better. Everything keep getting a little better. Ten years from now, you mark my word, ten years from now, everything going to be still the same. Why should I tell you? Why should I tell you now? I'm telling you, you're going to be looking like, man, ain't nothing changed. You know what I'm saying? They, they'll keep a, put a little inch on this, a little inch on that, a little inch on that. Man, what you know what I'm saying? That ain't moving nothing, baby. You want to move something, move mountains. You dig what I'm saying? You feel me? Real talk, move mountains. If you want to really show the people that you can back up what you speak, what you uh, put out there. But you ain't showing the people nothing because you sitting around here. Some governments, whoever get to be a government, I don't care if you're black or white. Like Rock Obama. I ain't vote for none of them because you know why? I'm going to tell you something. Some people opt for fame. Some people opt for the power. And some people want to get vote to have the money. To get their pockets fat so they can eat. Which I can respect every person trying to eat. But if you after all these things and you can't go in that White House and you can't change nothing. And everything's still the same. What kind of mess is that? You ain't really, you ain't really doing nothing for me. Then then you want to get things right. Boost, try to help people, the ones that know they got problems, and social security and all that, and you and and, and, and they showing records on certain levels, and school people can't read because they've been you know slow slow class or they got a back problem. They showing proof and everything. You know what I'm saying? Don't matter if you ain't work at all the rest of your life. If you work doing side jobs. Because sometimes people get out of prison or jail or whatever, right? And they can't really get no, no real job. So they got to work up on the table to make their money. And they probably been working for all the years, 20-something years, but got hurt. But knowing y'all, you, you ain't going to hide no high bitch with a felony person. So they got to get out there to find a job to stay out of trouble. But y'all still don't get a person no chance. That because he's not in y'all system, ain't never worked it. But you still turn around and tell him, oh, no, you ain't got enough in. You got to work three, four, ten more years to have some in to get it, get something back. What kind of mess is that? You feel what I'm saying? But y'all the one, the people that, uh, I ain't going to say all of them, but some of y'all cooked all this up. When you a high bitch with felony man, I don't care about black people, white people, y'all show a hell of a, hell of a, like, prejudice stuff towards us. Like, it's crazy to me. I'm like, man, you know what I'm saying? Y'all ain't open your eyes up to a lot of things, man. You know what I'm saying? You ain't really helping nobody. That's why I don't vote because you don't help nobody. You don't help the felonies. You don't help nobody, man. You know what I'm saying? That's why ain't no sense of people that got felony. I don't care if you got a felony, how bitch with felony, whatever. You ain't going to still see what you want to see. So, remember why most blacks and white, they have their own little business, little smaller business. The reason why they'll try to help the small business people, I'm going to tell you why. That's still money for the government. Taxes, y'all. And everything in it, you heard me? Taxes. So they don't really care. You feel what I'm saying? But they think it's a legit business. When you're selling beer, liquor, wine, that ain't no legit business. I'm going to tell you why. Liquor will bring you pain. Uh, cigarettes and all that, lotto and all that, that'll bring you prank. You know how you gonna find somebody coming to store trying to rob you. You find somebody trying, you know what I'm saying, gonna shoot you because they don't come there get the beer and liquor. They people be selling cigarettes. People be trying to rob lotto people. You know what I'm saying? All 
all that stuff, man, ain't nothing but a hurting game. It don't do a hurt you in the long run. I'm telling you, God know that why he tell, her, he tell us right now today. And y'all can look crazy, act crazy all you want, you feel me? God tell us right now. He tell you don't live for the world, live for live above the world. That means he don't want you to believe when any man say come out of any man's mouth. He say have your trust and faith in me. And I give you, grant you all these things. But we sit back and we think we don't lie, lie, lie. You heard me? But we not. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you around here sleep off you want to, it's going to be pick a boo. Pick a boo. <laughs> I'm telling you, hey, I'm going to tell you something. Most people, the way I talk, most people think uh, I'm, I, I, don't talk, I don't talk with sense, but I do. I talk with plenty of sense. You feel what I'm saying? They just be looking at me like, you know what? And then when they see me again, be like, you know what, man? You right. You, you right. I had to think about it, but I thought you were just talking off the wall. But then like, they sit back and like, you know what? That dude hurt. And it ain't, it ain't no rocket side to letting you know what's going on around this generation. Don't be dumb to the fact that you're going to be blind for the rest of your life. You feel what I'm saying? The system worked by us, us people. I don't care what color you is. When you stop working for the system, guess what? The system stop. They don't have nothing. They don't have nothing to go by. They don't have nothing to live by. And what I mean by that, once this world stop and God stop it, who's going to take care of us, baby? Hmm? Who's going to take care of us? Then everybody want to turn to God. I believe me one day the world gonna stop, baby. It's gonna it gonna it gonna freeze up. Real talk. You see all this stuff dropping down. When this corona goes, some mess gonna fall out the sky. You heard me? And you can say, I'm we talking like that. I'm for real, cause you know why? Cause we y'all certain us out there right now uh peeping on one thing in life, it's money. How they can rule the world, how they can have more to live lifestyle than everybody else living. Lord have mercy. Hey, I'm gonna be free. I'm gonna be, hey, I got Todd talking right now. I'm gonna be, uh, be for real with y'all, man. Man, I'm telling you something, man. It's gonna be a lot of hurt people, man. And you can say I'm talking stupid all you want, but I'm gonna tell you something. Y'all gonna realize you heard this from me. Because this world is finna stop. One day. And when it stops, everything frees up. And then everybody wanna turn to God. You might want to turn to God now nah, while the world's still turning, you hear me? Because if you don't, when it frees up, don't be talking about God and God. Because some of y'all, man, y'all getting so fancy now. You know what I'm saying? When God get ready to break this world back down, you know what I'm saying? And when he come to destroy and Jesus in the sky, he come to destroy, cast up the dead, whatever. Guess what? We going to be still. He gets up to destroy the world. If he puts some of us back in the time, like in the woods and everything, like the old generation came up, man, it's be a lot of y'all out there ain't going to know how to eat. A lot of y'all out there, you don't been through the struggle, you don't know how to eat. But a lot of y'all don't got used to the money now. You'll forget about what you did, how you used to do in the struggle. Because some people say, I want to forget about that. You can't never forget about that struggle because you might go back to that struggle. How you going to forget about something that what you've been through? Always be a reminder of things that what you've been through so that'll make you greater to go towards God. Not make you greater to go toward more money and you knowing that money is the root of all evil. Well, everybody know that. You feel what I'm saying to you? Everybody know that. People say, don't look back. Keep pushing towards stuff greater. Yeah, if you want to don't look back and push forward and look towards God, yeah. But if you want to don't want to look back, you want to push forward towards materialist thing, money, how you can live and all this and that there. Got another thing coming. I'm going to tell you something. You either going to want your ticket to go to hell <laughs> or you want your two ticket baby to get to heaven. I want my 10 tickets, baby, you know what I'm talking about? I want my 10 tickets, you dig what I'm saying, yo, you know what I'm talking about? I don't know what you want. I want 10 tickets, baby, you know what I'm saying? That be all fully, fully got 
my way of trying to get to hell. You heard me? You got to, hey, you're entitled to your own life how you want to live. You're entitled to your own life how you want to live, baby. Real talk. You feel me? I ain't going to judge. I ain't judge nobody. I ain't going to buy for nobody. You're entitled to your own life. And, uh, I just wish, man, that everybody just get along, stick together, but if you can't, man, it is what it is, so, you know, you know, I, I just had to say this here, you know, I'm finna get off this thing, y'all, and I appreciate all the love and everything, the respect, you know what I'm saying, I hope y'all listen to me, understand me, you dig what I'm saying, because, you know, ain't nothing in this world gonna be promised to us, real talk, you know what I'm saying, so, you know, um, a lot of people think this corona gonna ease all, ease away so quick and everything else. You know what I'm saying? Me, I just put everything in God's hands. I don't care if it stays to go. Because you know why I don't care? I'm going to tell you why I don't care. I don't control what God put down. Can you try to help it? Fix it? Maybe, maybe not. You feel what I'm saying? But man can't never outdo God. Man can try to. He can try to put that little technology to work, what they got going on. You feel me? But man can never outdo God. Remember that, y'all. A man can't cure everything. That When God puts certain stuff down, he, what he doing, he dropping to get a little taste of our medicine. When he puts certain stuff down, a man can't even go behind that and go behind and think they're going to fix some or bring up some medicine just to help us. No. So y'all don't be tricked and fooled by everything man say a man do. I'm telling you. I'm going to tell you something. If you want to listen, y'all, listen to a certain type of people, it's totally up to y'all. But if you really want to listen to somebody, look at that good book, baby. The most high. He telling us right now, and I ain't talking about listening to me. You can do what you want. It's a free country, free world. It's up to y'all. You feel me? If I just bring this knowledge to you, baby, that's it. That's all I'm going to do. You heard me? But anyway, y'all, let me get off this thing, man. You know what I'm saying? I got, man, I got the white clothes. You dig what I'm saying? That's what I'm doing. Woo, 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 woo. Yeah, feel me. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm saying? But anyway, y'all, y'all be safe out there. You know what I'm talking about? And please, y'all, please. I know it's a little light back there. You feel me right here, mess me all up. You dig, but it's all good. You know what I'm talking about? So, maybe next time I st stick something there to make it a little better. You dig, but it is what it is right now, y'all. So, anyway, let me get off this thing, y'all. You know, I appreciate everything, everybody out there. Just creep on, you know what I'm saying? Showing love to each other and then show how we can respect one another, how we can talk to one another, get each other. You know what I'm saying? To the most high. You, you feel me? But um, I probably link and talk about something else. You know what I'm saying? About, uh, about everybody being everybody else's business. You heard me? But anyway, I want to stay on this thing too long. It'll be the next topic. You dig what I'm saying? And I'm going to come right back at y'all. You heard me? And believe me, when I come, I come. You know what I'm saying? I come 1,000. You know what I'm talking about? I don't change nothing. You know what I'm saying? Not nothing. You know what I'm saying? Not nothing. Ooh, but anyway, y'all, I'm going to sign off on y'all. You feel me? You know what I'm talking about? So, hey, y'all, much love out to everybody out there. You feel me? But anyway, out of five thousand. You know what I'm saying? Love y'all later. You know what I'm saying?